John Pierpoint Morgan History Part 10 Faced with recurring business slumps, mounting competition and declining profits, the boldest businessman experimented with new ways of creating financial stability. The first attempt to overcome destructive competition was the formation of pools or cartels. These were agreements among competitors to divide markets and forbid price cutting. As early as the 1817s, pools were formed to divide markets, fix production quotas and set prices. Over the years, pools became trade associations, which devised method for dividing markets and assisting failing firms. The problems with pool was that they rarely survived an economic contraction. Financial depressions tempted some firms to cut prices and seek a larger share of the market. Pools were too weak to solve the problem of competition because they were voluntary agreements. An alternative was the trust, under which owners of rival firms assigned their stock to a single board of trustees in return for known voting. Interest-bearing certificates. The trustees then fixed prices and marketing policies for all the companies. John D. Rockefeller's Standard Oil Company was the first trust. Half a dozen industries followed, including alcohol distilling and sugar refining.